Park Asterix is a theme park based on the famous comic book series Asterix and with it being home to over 35 world class attractions it is easy to see why it is so popular. However today we're going to count down the top 10 rides at Park Asterix. Starting off at number 10 we have Menhirs Express and no matter whether you are heading to the park on a hot French day or are just looking for another fun family log flume then this is the ride for you. Themed towards Obelex delivery surface as soon as you've boarded one of the many floating Menhirs you will venture around many relaxing twists and turns allowing you to see some amazing views across the park. However, this is not all ease delivering, as not only will you experience many drops, dark tunnel sections and head to extreme heights, but you will also have a mini roller coaster section in the middle, which is pretty awesome if you ask me. If Men Here Express did not get you wet enough though, then do not fear as our number 9 position let Oxygerium will sure do the trick. Situated within the heart of the woods from the moment you and up to 7 others set off on your adventure you will have no idea where you will be going and oh boy are you in for a treat with along its 195 meter layout it featuring everything from big drops to sharp turns to even a few moments of air time all whilst your boat is spinning around creating an experience that you will never ever forget and therefore we think it is perfect at the number 9 spot. Have you ever wanted to head on the famous Trojan horse? Well if so then you must take a ride on our number 8 position, Le Cheval de Troy, because as you can probably guess by the name you can do just that. Nevertheless before we do begin to talk about the ride itself, with this ride type being a very common type of attraction all around the world, if you are heading to the park on a busy day then we would suggest riding the more unique attractions first, yet if you do get a chance to ride then you will definitely not be disappointed with your flying carpet style gondola rotating around and around faster and faster into the air both forwards as well as backwards too. How awesome is that? It is time for our first roller coaster on the list as taking our number 7 spot we have Vol de la Care and despite this being a family coaster this definitely packs a punch with it featuring many twists, turns and drops at a pretty fast speed of 26 miles per hour. However what makes this ride so amazing for me is the seat formation as where else in the world can you roll a roller coaster like this in a single file and so if you take away the fact that it can be pretty rough at times especially on those sharp brake runs then you should definitely take a ride on Vault de la Care. You can't have a theme park without a unique credit and Park Asterix is no exception as our number 6 spot Pegasus Express has taken the words unique and fun to the next level. Now do not get me wrong, this so called family attraction has got all those much beloved Gerslauer bank turns, drops, airtime hills as well as some over water and in tunnel sections. But what brings this ride to the next level is the fact that in addition to this you also have two launches and one section where after some very clever special effects you head backwards. Yes, you heard me right, backwards. So if that does not make you want to ride, I honestly do not know what will. Top 5, Woot Woot and coming in for this position we have Disco Bilex. And wow, where do I begin when talking about this ride? 
as even though it is your classic San Perla Disco, the theming towards this attraction is quite literally godly, with all of its Greek structures surrounding it, as well as the humongous Obelix statue and the temple too. However, it does not stop there, as once the ride begins, which I will let you know, is absolutely incredible with the spinning disc rising up and down as well as rotating on the W-shaped track. There are water and fire effects constantly going off, creating one of the best flat ride experiences in the world. For our number 4 spot on our top 10 list, things are starting to get a lot more intense as we have traced the horror the park's bobsled coaster, and for anyone who does not understand what this is, well in a nutshell it is a hybrid between both a roller coaster and a bobsled, and trust me when I say this is not for a faint of heart, because not only will you complete many sharp twists and turns, helixes and drops high in the air, but you also have no track and you do not need to be a rocket scientist to know that is both extremely scary and cool at the same time. Here we are at the top 3 rides at the park, and for this position we have Goodrix, and ever since its debut back in 1989, despite this being very, and I mean very rough, this has always been a fan favourite. Featuring such elements as a batwing loop, double corkscrew and a one of a kind butterfly loop, just looking at this 118 foot high yellow ride on the lake is absolutely amazing. And this only continues on the ride itself, where of course, if you are brave enough to ride, completing all of this at a speed of 56 miles per hour, causing even the biggest thrill seekers in the group to put their hands in the air. Between number 2 and 1, it was tough, however after a lot of consideration, we have decided to put the new for 2022, Tonneur Zeus at number 2. Previously known as Tonneur du Zeus, this wooden roller coaster has always been amazing, with its custom route consisting of many drops, airtime hills and tunnel sections, However, with its recent Gravity Group retrack, this ride has been taken to the next level, with the turns becoming more banked, the drops becoming steeper, and so much better airtime moments as well as so, so much more. Therefore, in my eyes, a trip to Park Asterix is nowhere near complete without a ride. We have made it to the number one spot, and for the best ride in our opinion at the park is going to Osleris. And wow, this ride is amazing. Themed towards an Egyptian temple. From the moment you see this ride with all of its models, buildings, water effects and of course the layout itself, you will instantly want to jump aboard. And you should sure do that because on ride this just gets 10 times better with you racing around all of this whilst also completing some of the most fun and intense elements that I have ever seen before. Therefore with all of this as well as the fact that you do the entire ride layout with your legs dangling, there is no doubt that in my mind this is the best ride at Park Asterix. Thank you all for watching. And see you next time. Bye bye.